How's it going, guys? I'm going to be playing again, so let's just jump right in. Okay. So. Back to where we were going. This is the last save, save section. We're going to crouch. And we're going to see where this takes us. What the oh, hell happened here? Pretty. Japanese. Why aren't they showing one thing in Japanese and another thing in Chinese? Or is it all in Japanese? Nostalgic. It's so true to the movie style. It's very nice. Baggage claim that is going to be powered. I hear noises. That's fine. Noises are fine. I want to make sure that it's clear. Because I don't know what's going on right now. That was motion. You can't tell me that's not. I was about to contemplate the technologies in this station. Like, why I have to power up certain sections of the station in order to receive updates and stuff like that. Zoe, I'm sorry, but I won't need you to come in next week. As you know, the store's been in trouble for some time, and I can't hold off the creditors any longer. There's just no one to come in too sad fast to pull anymore. It's not just us either. It sounds like the whole station is in the red and they're pulling the plug. They're going to sell it off for some scrap, I guess. Speaking to one of the engineers and he reckons that they'll announce it soon. I'm telling you this so that you don't get stuck around looking for another job. Sebastopol's finished. Time to move on. Okay. To all space flight terminal employees, in the interest of public safety and the prevention of panic, it must be made clear to all potential passengers that there are currently no scheduled flights leaving Sebastopol. No snore ships available. The Colonial Marshals are investigating problems on station and will update accordingly from the Office of Marshal Waits. Space Cops. Tonight on Space Cops. Julia Jones, today's update. After numerous demands, Marshall Waits finally called a public meeting to address the rumors that have been circulating on Sevastopol. But instead of the answers we wanted, he continued to be evasive, and after only a few minutes, he and his team were pelted by projectiles from an angry crowd. A gun was fired, there was pan- Now Waits and what's left of his team are forcibly ejecting us from the terminal. Feels like we're on our own now. That's very eerie. But there was nothing in here, right? 
right? Damn place is falling apart. Yeah, no kidding. Got that right, sister. I really don't like that. But I mean, hey man, I guess you gotta do what you gotta do if you're surviving in a station like this. Everyone for themselves, right? But, you know, whatever. Oh, is that a key cat? Is that, is that Jonesy? Here, Jonesy, 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 Jonesy. Jack required. Oh, that's good. Um. Plasma torch required. Well, where am I supposed to find all this stuff? Don't do that. Reverse, this is Turner. I found the last power coupling. Took me a while, but it's off now. Just getting the last security brace. Come find me when you shut yours down, then we can get the hell out of here. Jesus, man, I'm hearing noises everywhere. Every creak and... Just hurry the fuck up, will you? Mm -hmm. Hold the hide. Why do I need to do this? Mother, is this a mother? I don't know why I need to be here. Well, that's why. Reverse, it's Turner. Got to deal with that wasted asshole again. This time, he nearly wrecked the door with a maintenance jack. Guess he figures it's safe here. Wants to lock himself in. Screw him. We got too much to worry about without babysitting drunks. Anyway, I threw him in the evidence lockup. Let the son of a bitch sleep it off. Okay, that's fine. What was that? Wait, were you telling me that there's a maintenance check in the office? Is that what you were telling me? Oh, fuck. Yeah, 
Yes. That is a dead person. Do I have to go in there? I think so. Okay, I think I'm gonna stop it here because I feel like I'm getting close to like a 20 minute mark, so... Thank you so much for watching. You have a lovely day. I'm gonna pick it up right after this.